get the Pentagon. Class A emergency. The Joint Chiefs of Staffs are expecting the call. The rocket has just been entered by a robot. It lives. Life? Consciousness? A machine? It intends to put itself section by section into orbit around the Earth. And from that day forever forward, Earth will be its slave. made invisible by mysterious scientific force. Held in the sinister power of the berserk electronic brain machine developed by the boy's father, famous scientist, Dr. Tom Marino. You have 58 hours. If at the end of that time you have failed to supply the required information, the boy will be destroyed. Top scientists and brass from the armed forces confer on the emergency. One by one, they are trapped and microscopic transistors implanted in their brains. Each one of us must submit to a physical examination by Dr. Bannerman. May one ask why? Because at least two of us here, and maybe more, have one of these surgically embedded in their skulls. Which means they're completely under non-human control. Dr. Marino, you have been informed of the situation. My robot is already in space, and your son is completely in his hands. Marino, I direct your attention toward the television screen. You and your wife will remain here, and you will be obliged to look and listen. Are you ready, robot? Ready, master. Good. You may begin with his eyes. Ah! 